Hello everybody, my name is Hamid and uh, we are going to install and use SmartThink application to monitor your asterisk or elastics IP pebbles. At first to connect to elastics you should install SmartThink module on your elastic server. When you, when you log into your elastic server you should go to add-ons page in this tab and uh, on third page you can found SmartThink module here it is you can use the SmartThink as free and uh, there is no limitations of features on free version just some limitation on counts of objects for example on free version you can see just 15 extensions or you can see just 5 queues of your queues also you can buy from Elastics Store So we are going to install trial version or free version. You know at first you should register your elastics and then we are going to install it. You should have access to internet on your elastic server. It is now installed so we are going to see SmartThink tab just refresh your tab no different which one you can see SmartThink tab at the last here is a SmartThink module for elastics at first, we are going to define a SmartThink user. You should choose one of your extensions, for example, 1101. Choose your password. And uh, you can set permissions for this extension. I set all of them to yes. Now I have one user. To monitor my elastics from SmartThink application, the user or extension is 1101. This is my password. Also, I need another user, it is asterisk manager user. By default, we have this user and this password. If you don't know what is asterisk manager or AMI, don't change it. Just remember, your asterisk user is a smart thing, and your password is a smart thing with at sign instead of A and uppercase F. F. So, also if you bought a smart thing, you can enter your license here. If you want to use it free or light version, Make it empty, don't enter anything here. So it is done. We are going to install SmartThink Windows Desktop application. Okay? You should download the latest the latest SmartThink application from SmartThink.com and download part here 32 or 64 bits for your windows and then install this application like all other application on your windows
Now it is installed. Our smart thing. Windows application. We should connect it to our Acer server or our plastics. Make a new row. For example, my elastics. Our elastic server IP address. Here it is. Asterisk manager port by default is 5038. Don't change it. Our asterisk user and password for manager in second tab. I said that by default this is user and this is password so if you don't know what is it don't change the defaults and uh, the last user and password are extension number and a a smart thing password we defined this user and password on first tab here it is extension number 1101 and the password is 126 now you should select hold the hold the row and then save it now it is saved we can check it we close the form reopen it here it is we can connect to our Elastic server. Now we are connected. We can see the name of our main extension, our users. When you open extension panel, you can see all your available extensions here. In another video, I will learn you how work with smart thing with your queues with your extensions with your DHD PSTN lines you can monitor all of them you can manage all of them and this is the most useful application for asterisk that you can use on your windows thank you